Hello, thank you for joining us. This week we're going to be in the first epistle of Peter, the first epistle of Peter. In chapter 1, we're going to, today we're going to be in verse 3, tomorrow we'll be in verse 4, and so on. But today, in verse 3, it says, Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who according to his abundant mercy have begotten us again to the living hope through the resurrection of Jesus Christ from the dead. So what we're seeing today is that abundant mercy. Isn't it great that we have a, that Jesus gives, has available to us abundant mercy? Trust me, I need that. And that he has begotten us again to a living hope through the resurrection. Because Jesus got up from the dead. We have hope of no matter what happened in our lives, we are we can have victory because he got up. We can get up from the trials and tribulations and things that this world does to knock us down. I want to remind us this week that we talked about last week, the world wants three things from us. It wants our attention, it wants our energy, and it wants our allegiance. So I want us to realize that today that Jesus Christ, who has abundant mercy, has begotten us again to a living hope. A hope that lives because of his resurrection. A hope that lives because he got up. Yes, life gets tough. And yes, sometimes we get frustrated. But I come by today to tell you, it's time to get up. It's time to get up from those places of defeat. It's time to get up from those places of hurt. It's time to get up from those places of, uh, of pain. It's time to get up from those things that happened in the past. It's easy. It's not easy, I know. It's frustrating, I know. And why do I have to get up? when it's been so easy just laying here and letting me thinking that I'm defeated. But no, today I want us to get up because there's a living hope through the resurrection. A living hope through the resurrection. A living hope through the resurrection of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you next time.